Hi, good morning, good evening, good afternoon. I always mix those up. It's going to happen. It's kind of a running joke at this point. Um, it's Tragic Life here, back with Final Fantasy VII, The After Years. Boy, it has been a long time since I've recorded this. Um, we were very close to the end of this game. Um, I'm ready to finish it. I've been ready to finish it. And then my computer died. Otherwise, it would have already been finished. But um, we were still going down... Oh. oh, sorry. We left off with us heading down this, uh, through the subterranean of the True Moon. Well, we're on B7. Um, we're going to keep. Con we're going to continue our journey downward. I think it is. Um, this is going to be a hard floor. I'm going to try to do the entire floor. No promises. We will see how this goes. Um, go ahead and drop me. Drop the likes, subs, and comments if you want. Um, without further ado, we're going to move forward. Here we go. Okay, I don't know if you guys have seen these guys in Living Mill. They're not much... Really? Alright, they're not that much. Okay, I think we go in here, we're going to get a scene. It's currently about midnight, a little bit over midnight. I got to go to work early this morning, 3 a.m. It's the 19th. Charlie, like your, your tongue is really wet, sir. Like my ankle is now needs a towel. Talking to my dog, just to let you guys know. That could have sounded weird. Charlie, quit licking my foot. Love you. What? Licking my foot and his tongue is really wet. Lady Perome. Perome is fine. Oh, no, I couldn't speak to you in such a tone. You are the great white mage of Mycidia, my lady. No, please, call me Perome. The same way you prefer to refer to Perome. It's fine, really. Are, are you sure, Perome? <laughs> well, if you insist, I'm not going to stop you. Y yes, my lady. What were you thinking about? What, well, are you sure this is all right? Take any pop trainee like myself on a journey like this. Palam recommended you. What? He gave us a very convincing account of your natural talents. He talked about how, as your teacher, he feels responsible for you. Really? Mm-hmm. I, I really can't believe it. Are you regretting the journey? Oh no, not at all. I'm happy to be here. I'm, I'm so happy, in fact, that I forgot about how scared I should be right now. That's good to hear. Oh. I think I'm starting to understand why Palom hasn't brought up his dream of becoming a sage lately. What? What are you two talking about? Busted. Oh, it's... Luca? Look, I'm just gonna ask, do you like Paloma or what? What? That, that's a rather sudden question. I uh, simply meant that I admire and um, respect, I mean, as a teacher that is... Um, I'm not asking for all the gory details. You like him, don't you? Ah, oh, well, yes, yes, I do. Oh, well, good. Huh? That makes me feel a lot better. When we can be fair some things, sometimes. You are correct, sir. I mean, there, there are better times to have that a conversation than now. So we got the Ice Crush Band for Lenora, Paloma, and Luca. Um, I don't remember. Are those, are those three in my party? I don't think they are. I don't know. It's been a while. Let's find out. Luca, Paloma. All right. 
We got our life back. We're gonna come in here. We get the Murasama. Um, I don't know if anyone can wear that. Okay. I don't remember what my setup was, so... Alright, that was two living males. I'm gonna be right back. I wanna reset my armor up correctly. Um, I'm gonna actually gonna do it after this, let's see. Alright, be right back, because my armor is incorrect and I know that. All right, we're back. I just want to make sure. So I'm actually going to keep the cat claws instead of the metal knuckles because they can occasionally put um, the they can occasionally put them to sleep, which is always a plus. Um, okay. I know. Alright, go ahead and look at this. We're gonna get into a fight with some skull nets. They're pretty easy, though. Right. Alright. But nothing's ever that easy. Those zombies, we popped them on Mount Ordeals. I mean, not those ones exactly. I can see where this is going. Why do I feel like something terrible is about to happen to us? Desecrating the dead for his own purposes is deplorable. Come on out, you coward. All right. Haven't changed much, have you? I'll put you to sleep for good. Ah, I'm not doing that. So he has 22 to 35. Let's see. Wait, hold on. Really? Okay, so I can do. Okay. So he has 22 to 35,000 life. I'm not sure why there's two numbers there. Um, he's not that hard. Um, I'm going to make a couple moves here, so I'll kind of explain it as I move forward and as I'm setting stuff up. Alright, so he's going to do the Revenants. We're going to do a makeshift cannon. So he's going to counter with Undaga. It's going to hurt to keep your guys' life up. Um, the Black Mage... We'll cast fire again. He's weak to fire. Ah, uh, so he will actually die and then come back. Um, so his first form has twenty-five thousand, or twenty-two. His second form has thirty-five. Now I understand. need to stop attacking so much. Slow down. Keep your life up. Alright, 
trying to think through um, how to change weapons. I forgot. There's a way to do that. I just don't remember how. It's a Sundarker, Probably time to heal again. Not the hardest boss we've ever fought. This should probably wipe him. Really, bro? Before my very soul is crushed. Alright, just a heads up, not over. Okay, so um, now that we're here, we're gonna go ahead and hit him with slow. Okay, my black magic, come on. Seeing it, am I blind? Start As you can see, it's not that difficult. I really don't remember how to... ...change weapons, but I should be ch I should have changed my defender for the Lustrous Sword. Um, it does more damage. Okay, so black magic. Let's try uh, just because bio jelly does a really good job. Let's see what bio does. Do Delta Evolution because that'll hit him pretty hard. Um, I realized you were so low, man. Oh, 
far that did pretty good. So like we may need to give Ursula. I think we got this right now. So we need That was one of the elemental arch beans that left a bad taste in my mouth. We may have been enemies, but he lived on the same ground from which we are, are all born. So these are the monsters my father fought before. He may have been an enemy from an age gone by, but all the same, I feel a tad sorry for him. Okay, so we just picked up, sorry, I, that was really weird. Um, oh yeah, I got people poison. I have plenty of that. Alright, uh, we picked up a Stardust Rod, which I don't know if it's actually better than the Fairy Rod. It says it is. That's yeah, common, nice. Um, so now we have two 10 plus intelligent rods for black mages if we had two black mages. Alright. Um, so before anything, we're gonna go back and go save. Alright, that was two living males. We're not done yet. Uh, excuse me. Alright, um, yeah, that just kind of sucked. I'm getting all easy guys, but this time they want to throw something hard at me. Shadows and uh, to a living male. Alright, we're pretty good. Alright, should be a long bridge. Alright, that music kicking, it's kinda cool. Yeah, alright. Mm -hmm. Ah, so we're going into new territory.
to uh, right, meet new bad guys. Um, I don't think we've seen an Almon. I didn't get me a drink, but I'm sitting here drinkless. And a crocodile. I don't think we. I think we fought alligators. I'm not sure if we fought crocodile crocodiles. Okay. Um. Should be a white fang. Cool, cool, cool. Go back up. This time we're gonna go right. Um. Down to a ramp. Man, the music's kind of kicking. All right. Solid shutter. I didn't realize she was getting beat up like that. Potion, cool, cool. Go through the left wall, and we have a dragon now. like that one. Yes. Alright, unicorn horn. So now we're going the right way. Alright, that was another cro crocodile and almond. Two almonds. Almonds? Almonds? Are you serious? Like, you can't miss when you're putting them back into the human form. It's a weird fight. They don't really do much other than put us to toad land. They don't do a lot of damage beyond that. The one in the middle. Uh, oh, that okay. Sid. Well, uh, we under attack. It's me, Master. Oh, oh, Luca, don't sneak up on me like that. I'm impressed you can sleep so soundly in a place like this. You kidding me? I have to rest up while I can, you know? We got some serious work to do. Wise words from your decades of battlefield experience? 
You got that right. Hey, what do you mean decades? Anyway, Master, I was thinking about the end of this enemy base. Do you think we have what it takes to defeat him? I mean, look at this move. How do you mean? Doesn't it strike you that this moon almost seems like it was created by somebody? It's, it's almost like a gigantic craft of sorts. Glad to see you noticed. Perhaps Cecil and the others can deal with this well, but can I? Can either of us for that matter? You need to believe in yourself, Luca. This is your generation's time now. Master. Your knowledge and skill go way beyond anything I could ever achieve, Luca. You know, Cecil and his lot have been great aid to us all, but I look at you and at Theodore, and at your age you still have an infinite potential waiting ahead for you. Y yes, sir. Kalka, Brina. Hmm, looks like something's on the fritz with him. True, they could both use some maintenance work. There, let me take a look. Wait, wait, no, you can't. Why not? These guys are really fragile. You can't hammer away at them like you do the ship's engine. Since when did I say you could tell me how to work on machinery, eh, Luca? Well, I've been doing it for a while now, if you haven't noticed. Oh. Ha! Ah, do you think I'm going to retire to some country cottage with an apprentice like you running around? Forget it. That's not the issue here. Ah, uh, why do you have to be such a stubborn old man sometimes? Well, that got intense. Uh... We'd better fix this ASAP. Yes, sir. Apparently, Charlie is upstairs whining because I'm not in bed. He's very confused. He doesn't like it. All right, so the question is, that, does that heal me? Does that counter the cottage? It did. All right, we look like we're back to normal, so. I'm gonna run from this because I don't really feel like fighting a white dragon. We will be doing the dragon later. We got a boss fight, so I'm trying to get this ready. I'm not getting very much luck here. Alright. Probably gonna stop after this second boss. Um, apparently he's not he's not hard enough to even get a boss box in this thing here, uh, so I don't have any information on him. Not him. Uh, where are you? Show us. I can feel that someone's watching us. Enough, enough build up. Just come out and fight us. Hi. Hey, him. <laughs> Imagine seeing you again. Alright. Well, that, that was not a great start. So, we're gonna attack you here. He's not really weak to... He's very strong to physical attack. So, that's not where... We're gonna use Vazog on him. Um, and Thundaga occasionally. Um... Okay, so we're gonna cast Shell. Anything else I need to Um, so if, if he goes into a shell, do not do anything. So I said he's weak to what? The saga. Wow, 
that, that was really nice, actually. When he does this, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing. I'll be right back. Welcome back. So we're going to do this fight again. I was going to just show you me finishing it, but I decided that was probably not the best option. Forgive me. I, I got coffee and Eminem's. Keep my guys just like that. Oh, I didn't cast shell. Yeah, that was just a last minute thing there. I didn't have any other options. But anytime he does that where he's pulling energy, you want to hit him with a lightning bolt. I need to stop attacking because he's gonna.
All right, now we don't hit them, we wait. For every time you hit him here, he'll give himself 4,000 life. Wait. Oh. This is crap. I've been using the wrong magic on them. sleep was disturbed. <laughs> now I can sleep again. Okay. That, little, that last part kind of gets a little unfair, to be completely honest with you. But it would have helped if I was using Mazaga from the get-go. Hey, finally. Got some good stuff there. Obstinate as always, I see. This moon is a living night. My father fought against that creature, too. What is going on here? Why are the crystals bringing forth our past enemies? So, for all the enemies we faced before, back again waiting for us? That's a scary thought. Alright, we got Sage's Staff and a Sage's... Robe. Now, what's really cool here is the Sage Staff can actually... Raise when used as an item, so that's all it was. Alright, so this is where we're going to end it. Um, I'll see you next time. Adios, amigos.